In this video, we'll write the equation for this nickel 2 phosphate plus water. So we're going to take solid nickel 2 phosphate, we put it in water here, and the water, that's a liquid, and we want to know what the equation is. So we need to know whether this nickel 2 phosphate is soluble in water, if it will dissolve, because if it doesn't dissolve, there's no equation. So we have the solubility rules to help us. We're going down here, and here we go. Most phosphates are insoluble with a few exceptions. So this is insoluble. You put nickel 2 phosphate in water, it just falls to the bottom. It sinks to the bottom and remains a solid. So there's not much of an equation we could write. Do note that even though it's insoluble, a very tiny amount will dissolve. So we could write the equation for that tiny amount. We know that the phosphate ion is 3 minus. We have two of those. So the nickel has to be 2 plus. So we'll have three of these nickel 2 ions. And we'll have two of the phosphate ions. And we should put AQ for aqueous after them since they are dissolved in water. So this would be the equation for the very tiny amount of Ni3PO42 that dissolves in the water. Sometimes you'll see the water put on top of the arrow, but because this nickel 2 phosphate is insoluble in water, almost all of it will remain a solid and nothing will happen. This is just for the very small amount that dissolves. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.